Number one actually eh. Number one. Sketch the graph. Sketch the graph. Uh, quadratic linear on the same axis. Okay and find point of intersection. Okay, make sure you can sketch the graph. Okay sketch the graph. Quadratic. Quadratic. This is quadratic. Okay make sure ada X and Y. Label the graph eh. Okay, this is quite important because to get full mark for the graph, you, have, you need to label x, y, 0. The graph y equals x squared. Then, this is a, a straight line. When x 0, okay, 6, right? 6. When y 0, y 0, x is equal to 6. So, this is a gradient is... Uh, negative. So this is six. Label, label the graph. Label the graph. Enough, eh? This is for sketching. Okay. Label six, six, zero. That's enough. Okay. No need to do some something like that. Okay. So find the point of intersection. Okay. Means that you need to do simultaneous equation. Or uh, from the graph, you can uh, see that this is point of intersection. Okay. Sketch graph quadratic. And uh, fine, this one sketch okay. And the what is the relation between the two graphs? Means that here this is point of intersection. Okay, you get two right. Two. So if you sketch this graph, this is quadratic. Suppose you get the same uh, point of intersection. Okay, why exists? Ah, uh, this one. Okay, sama. Okay, relation. Okay, so you can relate. Okay. Ah, uh, number two, <coughs> quite good. Eh? Number two, one. Hey, Madam Devon, Devon. Uh, so that there exists a root between 0 and 1 by using graphical method. Graphical method, kita mau gra plot graph dulu. Okay. Mula-mula, uh, hmm. okay. hmm? x minus negative 2 bawa ke sebelah kanan. Okay. So, uh, so, hx equals to negative ex, gx equals to 2 minus x. Okay, good. So, so more plot graph. Mm. When, when x equals to 0, y equals to 2. When y equals to 0, x equals to 2. So, gx would plot graph. Lepas tu, more plot graph untuk hx. Okay. Ex when x equals to zero, y equals to one. When x or x equals to in, infinity, y equals to infinity. So, the okay. okay. First, to add a intersection point cut uh, between zero and one. Okay. So there is an intersection at x axis between x equals to 0 and a x equals to 1. This implies that there are a root between them. Okay, good. Okay, uh, settle. Uh, that one's, uh, okay, perfect. Okay. Okay, so the equation is Tapi show exists a root between 0 and 1 by using algebra. So, equation 2, kita jadikan dia as a function. Lepas tu, mungkin kita dah ada bila bagi unit 0, 1, 1 ni. Kita substitute kat dalam function tu. And then, kita dapat yang F0, kita dapat jawapan negative 1, which is less than 0. F kita substitute dengan 1 kita dapat 1.718 which is more than 0 so kat sini we show that there has exist a root between 0 and 1 itu je Okay, clear. Very good. Yes, yeah, same like uh, this one uh, that present perfect. Uh, full mark. Okay, then. Okay.
Continue. Number five, dia suruh by using the Newton Repsol method uh, to find the root of the equation as exponent x equal to 1. Lepas tu, mula kita kena plot graph dulu. Kita kena sketch graph dulu. Why you sketch graph? We need to sketch graph. Kita nak cari intersection. Uh, kita nak cari nilai x. X1. Hmm. Uh, so do you have a uh, different method? Other method? Anyone? No, we do. Yeah? Algebra method. Ah, okay. Oh, Algebra uh, method. But it's okay you use a graphical method. It's okay. Okay, this is a very good. Actually very good sketching. Okay. Uh, okay, uh, continue dulu. Hazim continue dulu. Sampai habis. Turun sikit, Fidim. Turun sikit. Hmm. Okay. Itu daripada graph kita dapat approximately value of for x is equal to 0 0.5. Okay. Okay. So, 0 and 1, right? Yeah. Okay, good. Itu dia bagi equation uh, fx equal to x exponent x minus 1. Itu kita cari, kita differentiate ya. Dapat exponent x plus x exponent x. Pakai product rule. Very good. Itu uh, kita masuk ke dalam formula dia yang x1 eh x2 equal to x1 minus fx over f prime x1. Okay. Kita masukkan dalam formula tu. Masukkan 0.5 dalam x, x1. Okay. Tekan, lepas tu tekan kalkulator dapat 0.03552 to x2. Uh, how many decimal places? 4 or 3. Okay. Okay, Untuk soalan 5, kita sudah guna Newton Raksan Method to find the root of the equation. Equation dia bagi yang ni. Kita nak cari dia punya root dia. Kita guna formula yang ni. Dia bagi, dia sudah guna fx dengan f prime x. Kita tukar lah jadi f prime x yang ni. Lepas tu, f f prime x yang ni. Yang ni fx. Lepas tu, kita nak cari nilai X dia Kita ganti dengan Kosong dengan satu So kita dapat Skedar negatif satu lagi kecil daripada kosong Satu poin tujuh dua lagi besar daripada kosong So saya pilih Kosong poin lima X sama dengan kosong poin lima So ganti dalam formula Ganti dapat kosong poin Kosong lima Tiga lima lima dua Lepas tu yang ketiga dapat 0.993322 Sampai yang ketujuh dapat 0.5614 Sama dengan 0.5 eh, Sama dengan nombor 8 So Yang tu dah jawapan dia Pakai 4 decimal places Untuk nombor 6, dia suruh find the root of the non-linear equation dia bagi yang ini. Kita nak uh, by using the Newton Raphson method up to the fourth iteration. Fourth iteration ni maksud dia four decimal places. Given that the first approximation root is 1.3, itu maksud dia x equals to 1.3 lepas tu kita nak guna formula yang ni ada fx so yang ni fx dia lepas tu ada f prime x f prime x kita differentiate dia dapat yang ni lepas tu kita ganti masuk dalam formula 1.3 kita masuk dapat yang ni 
3.16824 Lepas tu Kali kedua Ganti pula Masa dapat ini. ni Lepas tu yang ketiga Dengan keempat Kita dapat 2.24268 Sama dengan Nombor empat So kita Ambil ini jawapan dia X sama dengan 2.24 